Bob Marito Automotive Group Sky Fox over a police pursuit that ended in a deadly crash. This is near Martin Luther King Drive and Cora Avenue in North St. Louis. Fox 2's Patrick Clark is there live with what we're learning. And Patrick, several people were sent to the hospital. Yeah, that's right, Mandy. We're finding out that there were five people transported. Two of those were children. Uh, we're finding more details about this as the as the afternoon has wore on. Take a look behind me. We're, as you said, the intersection of MLK and Cora, where the street is closed. A number of law enforcement on the scene. As you mentioned, Bomarito Automotive Group Skyfox over the scene of what appears to have been a pursuit that ended here. We heard from St. Louis County Police who responded at 1.30 this afternoon to a theft and employees assault at a dollar store off Hall's Ferry in North County. There was a pursuit with a Kia Optima and that car eluded police. Now police later caught up with it again. They deployed spike strips near Riverview and Hall Street. Now St. Louis County Police say it's unclear if the spike strips were successful, but the car crashed, as you saw in the video here, at MLK and Cora. Both St. Louis City and County Police were on the scene when we arrived earlier this afternoon. Now St. Louis Fire responded saying they confirmed there were five individuals that they transported for treatment to a hospital. Two were children. St. Louis City Police Sergeant Charles Wall telling Fox 2 News they are handling crash portion of this investigation. Both the accident reconstruction as well as the force investigation unit responding to the scene and the information they have is that an adult male has been pronounced deceased as a result of this crash. I heard it, but I didn't know what was going on, so I, we came on to just find out what's going on. Of course, there was a lot of commotion, a lot of things that were, you know, people were trying to gather to find out what was going on. There's something that we were going to have to do as a community because there's children that come back and forth to the street. There's a lot of people in the community that come to this gas station and come down to the other business that are there. And so that's just unfortunate. So we're praying for the families that are affected by all of this. Yeah, we talked with that Pastor Crusoe who has a building and a church just across the street here. He uh, told us this is a heavily trafficked street. Right now it is closed at MLK and Cora. As you can see behind me, there were those Spire trucks. We are told by Spire that there were crews working up here in the area, but none of their, their employees were injured this afternoon. In North St. Louis, Patrick Clark, Fox 2 News.